good getting internet. Yeah. Uh, it's been a while since I've recorded one of these. Quite a while. Uh, to be fair, with all of the screw-ups before, um. it was a bit odd what was going on. Okay, good. It stopped. Um, for some reason, there was skipped frames right at the start. I don't know why. Weird. Okay, anyway. Um, yeah, that number is actually not going up, so it should be fine. It looks like it was just a hiccup at the start. Mm. So where we last left off, um, which has been far less time for you all than it has been for us, <clears throat> um, we had some time travel shenanigans going on, but we're back now. We're just recording episode by episode at this point. Uh, and... We finished up talking with everybody at Strauss Eklund. Strat. Stroud. Stroud Eklund. And we need to return to Walter for more stuff. And there's our hubby. Uh, and we married twice, apparently. apparently. Yes. Well, what do you expect? Okay. Cockpit. Undock. I don't know if I have contraband nice. on me. Clean set there. I don't think I do. Pretty sure you don't, but let's have a look at your inventory. What? I can't hit I from here. No, you can't. That's obnoxious. No, I definitely don't. Yeah, but do you have any on your ship? No. Okay. We're, we're good. Let us head back. Hmm. To the lodge. And let's pick up a different companion. Yep. I agree. I suggest Andresia. That's what I was thinking. Although... I... Oh, maybe I don't currently have? No, I have to have him with me. Otherwise he wouldn't be in the star yard. Would right. He? So where did he go? Like, he's not following me. Hmm. Weird. Hope my employees don't give you too much trouble. I'm expecting right, big things from you with this ship project. Don't let me down. Well, oh. Until next time. At this point, I don't care what you have to do to get that project back on track. Within reason. <laughs> well, Speaking I, of within reason... I'm, well, at least I didn't hack his computer system, as we found out that you can do. Yeah, so I just did this on my third character, and I failed to persuade uh, Jules to go with a kitchen sink budget, and I didn't want to pay 100,000 credits of my own money to get it. So I had to go uh, to one of the computers in the yard, yard and approve the budget. <laughs> in this case, I just gave a donation to the world, uh, the universe's richest man. You know, normal stuff. So I managed to get your new ship project back on track. Good to hear. I figured as much. See, I just finished looking over the final design they sent over before you arrived. I've got to say... It's certainly interesting. They managed <laughs> to cram just about everything they could into it. Honestly, I don't think it ever occurred to me to do something like that. I'll be honest with you. This is the most expensive ship we've ever made. <laughs> but I'm confident we can set a price point to make it work. Now I'd be happy to make it my new personal ship. Additionally... I want you to have one of the first off the assembly line for all of your hard work. Feel free to pick it up at the star yard. Thanks again. And level up. Unfortunately, because of how the commerce system works, you probably get less than 100,000 if you sell it. Yeah. And unfortunately, as I've figured out now that I've tried to actually use it, Mm -hmm. They designed that ship before the decision to re remove the refueling mechanic 
It has seven fuel tanks. It needs maybe two. Uh, there are so many ships that have too many fuel tanks. Because they decide they design them yes. for you need to have enough fuel to go to the furthest reaches and back again. Mm-hmm. Okay. I need to kill more ships in order to be able to pilot class B. Or, yeah. No. Or the class C. Yeah. Yeah. Which this is class C, isn't it? Yes. The uh, so... smaller budget is... Yeah. Class A. Actually, it seemed... When I just did this quest again on my third character, it seemed like there was a option of going Captain, with an even smaller returned. budget. Eight Maybe that would give you a class A. Indicates mm. that you are in good I will try health. to do that next time. Ever mm. since I got here, this has felt like home. These people are family. I hope it feels that way for you too. What did you need? Never would I have imagined to encounter something like the Starborn. Now I feel that rather than having answers, we only have more questions. You didn't use your problem. Ah, yes, we are. Holy shit, I ain't never, never would I have imagined to, to encounter something like the Starborn. I suppose this proves that idea succinctly. Regardless of how impossible they may have seemed before now, I must say that I do not like being threatened by anyone. I can agree with you there. You're clearly trying to scare us away from something, though. If so, what would that be? Clearly, these Starborn are connected to the artifacts, which would mean that they are also connected to that temple you found. Mm -hmm. Did they make these things? Have they appropriated them? This all implies there is something more, something we do not yet understand. You're not worried, are you? I am never worried. Cautious, perhaps. It has always been necessary to prepare for the unexpected. This is just a bit more unexpected than usual. It seems to be how things go here in Constellation. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> uh, I mean, things are did just get a lot more complicated. I was just getting used to how complicated they already were. We will need to be on our guard from now on. They seem to know much about us. Perhaps we can learn more about them to make it even. We should return to our search, then. There's still so much to do. Hey, if you go, I'll follow. In a romantic sort of way, not stalkery. <laughs> Straight some I'll gear. carry anything you need. Well, within reason. Okay, you only have Poison Storm. Might as well just leave that on Sam? It's Andresha. I mean, nobody... Each of the companions only have one specific weapon type that they prefer, right? Um. Yeah, I, I, Sarah has lasers. Mm -hmm. um, Andresha has particle beam weapons. Sam has rifles. And Barrett doesn't have a weapon skill. Okay. So we're going to also need to get Andresha particle beam. The body you love. Weapon. I mean, that's what she has. That's her default. I mean, a better Is something one. amiss? Hmm? You do Why not need to other? ask me if you may ask. You may just. Yeah. What's your favorite place in settled systems? <laughs> you might find it absurd, but honestly, the lodge. I have never been surrounded by such a remarkable group of people, present company included. It has been a very long time since I have been someplace that could possibly feel like home there are worlds beyond count out there but that feeling is rare and precious you ever want to captain your own ship i have done so in the past when necessary but i am not the best pilot and it seems prudent to apply my skills where they are most useful lately that means aiding you and that i think has worked out very well what do you like to do with your free time Honestly, I... I cannot answer that. 
So many years have been driven by survival in intense circumstances. Leisure time has... It's been in short supply. And I suppose I have conditioned myself to not think about it much. I do enjoy combat training, though I suppose that is hardly the answer you are looking for. I like shooting You've given me something to consider. Thank you for that. I yeah. hope that was informative. So, you ready to head back out? I look forward to it. Looks like it's tag you're in, Andreja. Tag indeed, Sam. We will see you later. I like you it when it's sight to behold. When she says, I have sharpened the blade just for this occasion. <laughs> okay, so we should try to get her a better you have weapon. have my attention. I am happy to... She currently... No, she didn't even have ammo on her. Ooh. Back to it, then. So we definitely need as to get her something. As much as I love something. uncovering new questions, I wouldn't... And we don't have a huge stash of weapons. No, we don't. In fact, we only have a few weapons on us that aren't primary weapons that we sell and none of those are particle beam no um there are not a lot of particle beam weapons in the game what would you recommend honestly at this point just give her heavy particle fuses and let her use her default weapon mm -hmm. yes i keep and maybe a couple of med packs they use med packs oh yeah Did not realize that. If you have the perks for it, they'll even use them on you when you're low on health. Mm. But that's the um, mm -hmm. le leadership perk. Goodbye. Mm. So, for reference, my other character doesn't have anybody I following have been them. I've idle here so... for a long time. I believe Barrett would describe this state as bored. <laughs> <laughs> um, so when you're seeing me be unfamiliar with companions, it's because this, what you've seen on recording is all I, the experience I have with them. Trash and recycling and compost? Oh, and paper. Anyway, um, where might we be able to find a weapon for her? At your level? No. Okay. In that case... I mean, you can always steal Jake's hangover cure. It's a big bang. It's, it's a particle gun shot... Uh, particle, particle beam shotgun. Is he free to use that? Yeah. I think I'm going to go after an artifact. Before it glitches. A temple, you mean? Yeah. Yes, a temple, I mean. Yes. Before it glitches. And I need to go after spaceships. Yes. Because I desperately need to. Although I'm very curious. Can you just not pilot the spaceship? If you have a spaceship that's a class that you can't pilot, what happens? When you try to make it your home ship, it tells you that you can't. Okay. Then in that case, I will. I think. Head out toward Vali Epsilon. Always a satisfying moment to return to your ship. Wrong place, wrong oh, the... time. And I can <laughs> You took out the jump drive. Yeah, right. Scanning. Damn it! I spin up the drive! We're leaving. We're... Sorry. Faster! Please, please, don't kill me! Thank you. you kill them now? Mantis? What's a mantis? Grab Jeff, the mantis. The mantis. Wasn't quite fast enough, but I think I could be. Open fire! Fire! Nope, not gonna be fast enough. Mm. Okay. And that also broke the encounter. Did it? So when you um. <laughs> When you hail the uh, merchant freighter, does it just ask? I thought we were oh, dead. No, okay. Okay. But, uh, those spacers were terrified. I can't believe it. We were saved by the mantis. Everybody keeps going on about this mantis. Who the hell is the mantis? I've had this encounter before, mm -hmm. haven't I? 
on this character, yes. Try a different dialogue yep, option. I'm going to. Mantis is a bounty hunter with a bit of a reputation. There must be some reputation. I've never seen anything like that. And so modest. The Mantis is a bona fide legend. <laughs> oh, man. So is it customary to give the Mantis some sort of reward? The Mantis never takes a reward. Bless you, sir. Uh, Ma'am. I can't believe we were rescued by you. Wait, so this is free? You both gotta be pulling my leg here. Yeah, I don't ask for a reward, but if you happen to give one, I'm not gonna turn it down. Happily, take this, uh, Mantis. So damn classy. Every hundred You're credits. my hero, Mantis. <laughs> well then, thank you, Mantis. Ship's repaired. We'll be heading out. Yeah, if you break the encounter by killing one of the spacers before they uh, turn non-hostile, then when you hail the merchant friend, you just get normal dialogue, mm -hmm. like trade, yeah. piracy. Well, scanner anomaly time. Oh, would you mind giving me some of the sparkling Landing water from behind. your Retro Yes. We got a fancy carafe at Ikea yesterday. I have no idea if that would show up on camera. Because I'm green screening. I guess I'll find out when I green screen it. You got an ice cube. I noticed. <laughs> it was very obvious. <laughs> we'll never grow weary of seeing places like this. But as I found out, the crab is not good at keeping carbonation. Oh, ionic liquids. Yeah. Are you gonna take some? Right, this is the character that actually does stuff. Also, I'm already losing my suit. Mm -hmm. A lot of ionic liquids, actually. Yeah, you probably have very low uh, thermal resistance overall. Yeah. Maybe you have a combination of... Um... It's only negative 16, dang it. Yeah. Freaking people that don't know what cold weather is. Mm hmm And because it's snow, it's hazardous weather. Yes, because snow is particularly hazardous. It just means lower visibility. Yes. And you know what? I'm not driving a craft because there are none. Not used to lead being the uncommon thing and ionic liquids being everywhere on the or ground. Or you just landed in a vein of ionic liquids. I know. You, you still get the scanner distortions. Yes. I don't get those anymore. But we're not running the same mod. Though. Where'd the scanner distortion go? Oh, that way. Yeah, I have a couple of mods that try to fix the issue with not having the marker to land that, but it's not working retroactively. My third character hasn't had a single one of these bug yet, but my first and second are stuck with two uh, quests to go get this power where I don't have a place to land that. And since one of them is the one um, Vladimir gave me, I can't go ask him for another, so there's like four or five powers that my main first oldest character mm -hmm. can't get. And now it's pointing me back at the razor leaf. Or near the razor leaf, I should say. Ooh. I was just going to say that I haven't seen an anomaly so far away from the site before there, isn't it? Yeah. New. 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 So for my second character, I decided to let the Starborn have Artifact New. Mm -hmm. And it has so far not made any difference along the plot. Maybe it does way later. Maybe. I'm getting away from it. It's full. That's nice. 
I'm just nails usually not. Remember, I have not encountered enough life to be able to have a mm -hmm. grasp as to what's common and what's not. I don't think I need that anymore. Have I ever met a quick beetle that wasn't at least a little hostile? I don't think I've ever met a peaceful quick beetle. Or and Andresia just decided to go running off. Uh, where's the next one? On the other side of Andresia, probably. Oh, yeah. I like the concept of this power, but it has such a short duration. Well, obviously you just need to level it up ten more times. Yeah. I also dislike how it doesn't tell, tell you what the duration is. It, it will say just a short time or something like that. Really? A lot of these powers and perks, they need a better description. I am hitting it, damn it. With the cowboy hat. Creators. There's so much that could be learned. Oh. Starborn. Yeah. Guardian new. You should try using your power on it. What is my power? Creator's peace. Causes them to abandon their weapons. Okay. Can I knock them unconscious, by the way? Yes. Okay. Where'd they go? Um, what you see in the scanner. And beyond. Andresia! She, of all people, should know not to do that. Your cabin fails! Oh. Witness the end of the case! not do anything. Always a moment to us. Cowards. You don't have a pickpocket. Oh, right. Other character. Well. Use a med pack before you. Oh, I didn't even notice I was injured. Bye. Oh, never mind. Hold on a moment. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Use a better weapon. Are you ha quite sure you don't want me to do I don't have any other med packs hotkeyed, do I? I don't think you have a whole lot on this character. I do. Hmm. I just don't have emergency packs hotkeyed for some reason. Because I don't have emergency packs. That would be a good reason why I don't mm -hmm. have a hotkeyed. Well, that's a problem. Well, let's not do the whole unconscious thing this time. I miss my other character already.
They have grenades? I do too. Not that I can hit them. You can't heal while you're I know that. Oh, and Andresia went to the other side of that. Alright. We are in fact. You have very little ammo. Are you prepared to die? All enemies are the Uh, I'm gonna die. There we go. Uh, where'd the body go? Oh, that's right. Yeah. <sighs> so that went poorly. So my theory is that they're not actually there. They're just projections. Oh, hello. Because they show up differently yes, on of uh, Sense Start of the, than everything else. They're white instead of yellow. Right. Hmm. Okay, so anyway. So I started blasting. Lift off initiated, Captain. Time to venture into that beautiful sky. I should probably take a quest for taking care of some pirates, given that I do need to destroy some ships. I know I could just go to the simulator Orbital and kill them that way, completed. but... I don't know, I don't want to. What's that Civilian shit? transport to unknown vessel. Please acknowledge. Yes. Why, Bethesda? Why? I need a mod that will add just add a cup of dialogue box with are you sure whenever you get up from your seat. This is seat. a commercial passenger transport liner wanting to alert you about hostels in the system. Oh really? Um I don't know, do you need assistance? No, it gave our passengers a bit of a scare, but the ship's A-OK. -okay. I mean, space is never dull. I'm glad you made it out in one piece. You and me both. Us friendlies have got to watch each other's backs out here. Safe travel, stranger. They didn't tell me where. Yeah, that annoys me a little. That's annoying. Of course there's hostile activity. There's hostile activity everywhere I go. Otherwise, I would go there. Mm-hmm. Maybe that's it. Yeah. Or maybe that's the ecliptic settlement? Hmm. If it is, then you can fight. I'm saving. Oops. Save. Saving is good. Yes, especially since my ship is actually a little damaged. But it's probably not worth repairing that little amount of damage. Full damage, that is. Isn't that... It's hard to see. Yes, we did. Our I was hoping to use it for piloting. Yeah, we're probably saving it for that. Yeah. But anyway, that was not at all what I was hoping it would be.
Well, I should be able to get a quest for defeating pirates around here somewhere, shouldn't I? Because I don't think I have any currently. Mm -hmm. Well, there's a uh, mission board at the entrance to the Astral Lounge. Yeah. Just looking at my quests, which I have many of. Yeah. I didn't visit Vlad's house in this character. I have a bunch of quests for going to Earth. And I have yet to visit New Homestead. But... I am trying to generally wrap up this character. So, let's go to... Go to Neon. One Have I mentioned that I am not fond of seafood? Corporate skills? <laughs> no! I have Reunion never heard of hiring the best and brightest of today for our future tomorrow. That direction. Submit your power. application. Yeah. Return of the interceptors will be one of the starship models. Don't worry. It's not just you. Yeah, Frank Rennick's all in a twist because his robot got vandalized. <laughs> we had a good laugh about it back at the station. I don't have any boundaries, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, there's two of them. Might as well take both. That one is in person, as in landing, yeah. and that one's a delivery of 444 kilos of adaptive clothing. Hello. Very good. The less I'm in Neon, the better. I've already gone through Neon with my other character. I don't feel like that should be a part of my recording experience for this character. And once more, it's Sunny and Neon. Ish. Ish. Engines firing. Here we go. All right. Hell of a view from here. Let's go take care of some pirates. has survived being hurled through space once more. I 
I've noticed. There's not much I can do about that one. We've lost grab jump. I'm aware. Shield. Yes, I did. Uh, I'm out of. Okay. Their shields are gone. One more. Easy money. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Having to fight hard for it. Four down. I took more damage than I would like. Grab drive is fully repaired. No, it isn't. What a relief. It's repaired enough for functionality. Yep, I took more damage than I would have liked. Yeah. But you had no way of knowing how many they would be, and hopefully they have some ship parts. I do wish the arrows indicating things around would Give, give an you indication distance. of which one is the closest. Yes. Make, maybe make it a little bigger if they're really close. No ship parts at all. Huh. Hold on. How many ship parts do you have left? They're in the cargo hold. Oh, right. In there. Eight. Eight. Not great. No. Not awful, but not great. Is there anything in this system that might let me get chip parts? Um. No, sadly, your battle was orbiting a gas giant. Often after a space fight, there's a crash site that appears on the... Oh, I never knew that. And it usually has one ship part in it. Mm. But not always. Oh, I guess I'm going to... Grimbridge. Oh, you haven't even been to Grimbridge. Nope. Fast inside of all hips and ground jump right now. Grab drive. Jump complete. Want to do it again just for fun? No? Uh, maybe later. Don't crash into that ship. Hey, over here. Uh, could you please spare a ship part? I had a good feeling about you. We just uh. need a little. Two units of ship parts will do. If you don't give it to them, uh, the ship will blow up. And you can take more ship parts from them. They have some already. But that's not nice. You're a lifesaver. Here. At least they pay you for, for it. Your help. Not a whole bunch, but they do pay. I usually get 3,000 for two ship parts. Hmm. Plant has life. Yep. Some life, not much. I can just survey this. My objective is out there, and there is also an anomaly. Anomaly? We're going there first. Okay. Oh, is that? No. No, we have to be on the radio ship quest line to meet June. Yes. Doesn't look very anomalous to me. Nope. Looks like standard. Yeah, battlefield wreckage. There's nothing here. <laughs> that stinks. Yep, that's a little boring. Yeah. Well, I guess I'm gonna go to the Crimson Fleet now. Where else am I gonna go? Alright. 
time to go pew pew a few more times. Was the only one. Sometimes there's just one. Well, that was easy. Check the planet to see if there's a crash line. Nope, not. Nothing. We were not so lucky this time. Well, uh, unfortunately, I still need to kill more things. How many more? Hmm. I can't remember if there is a mission board at Elios or not. Eleven. This is gonna take forever. I only have another, like, 19 minutes left. Yeah. So we should probably just do something else and then... Yeah. There will be incidental... It's along the way. You can yeah, I have go it. take some falling damage. <laughs> oh boy, I'll take nutrition. No, I would take environmental I know you out would. of those. You haven't maxed out uh, weightlifting. This is true. But I also can't currently. Hmm. How about going to Elios? The what? Pixel 2. I'm not familiar with that location. You have to forgive me. Yeah, I guess I'm just saving the perk because there's not really anything I would want to take right now. That you have completed the challenge. Yeah, yeah. that I can, I should say. So, what did you want me to do? Um, Ixel is a labeled system, I think. Right. Uh, no. no. Oh, it's in... yeah. Oh, there it, it is. is. Level 40. Remember, I am not that level. Yeah, but I think you can handle it. I mean, yes, I know I can handle it, but... Grab jump spinning down. Will you just look at those stars? What's that chip? What chip? Star parcel oh. freighter to unknown oh. vessel. I have an urgent package, hoping for some assistance. At least it well. The star parcel's fleet's got a load of these aging Deimos monsters. Built like tanks, but well past their warranty. It's gonna take hours to fix this, if we can get the engine back online at all. I mean, I... You know, I am actually kind of surprised the ship broke down. They do make good ships. 30 years ago, this ship would be a beast. <laughs> Maybe more like 50. I got a hot package that's paid for expedited delivery. They'll dock my pay if it doesn't get to its destination. Star Parcel will reward you well if you can assist. You can try to get a bigger reward with... Yep. I am kind of the poor right now. Involved and give... it's... I could maybe see upping my offer. Throw this away, we can both walk away happy. No, it's not that simple. You sure? Because I need more than that. You understand. You know what? I like you. Maybe we can work something out. Tell you what, I can pay you some credits from the discretionary fund, up front. Best I can do. Alright. Send over the package, I'll go for it. Excellent. All you need to do is drop this off to the ship Neon. services technician on Neon. They'll take it from there. Thanks for bailing me out of this nightmare. 
Neon. Let's what? Do that. Since you're not paying for fuel. I just wanted to scan the world. Mm -hmm. I assume this is where you wanted me to go. Yes, that's the place to go. Aren't you going to deliver a package? That's not time gated, is it? It sounds like it should be. But. Mm -hmm. It's also not, not like I'm going to be taking that. Landing site is clear. Let's head down. This place is under construction, as evidenced by the quarter of the landing pan. I am there. not sure rehabilitation can be a valid alternative to incarceration. Thank you for spoiling what's but going on, But I would be on, happy Andrea. to be proven wrong. Yep, there's the quarter of the landing pan. <laughs> that we didn't even bother using. Well, it's not big enough for your ship, is it? There's people there. Waiting for you to be in here shop to have it. No energy. wonder no one will work for you. My man is missing, and you're all just here, what? Waiting for him to wander back through the gate? Mr. Halftown, we are trying. But we don't have the manpower. And now half my crew thinks your little band of convicts is just waiting to drag us off and scrap us for organs. Mr. Halftown. Our security officer has been put into the infirmary trying to find your worker. We're doing everything we can. All I ask is that you and your crew be patient. You have nothing to fear from us convicts. We are handling it. Then get it done. Or else we are going to have problems. You have my word. Hey. First off, double checking. Yeah, there's no time limit or anything mm -hmm. like that. Uh, I'm sorry, are uh, you lost? Because if you're here to enroll someone, I'm afraid we're having a... Just a minor crisis. And it's Hello, going Liam to be a while before we're evaluating any applicants. That's Liam O'Brien's voice. Okay. I don't know who that is. One of the members of Critical Role. And voice acts for a lot, lot of different roles. Um, enroll someone? What? What, what exactly is this place? This is, well, will be the Elios Retreat. Someday we hope for it to be a bastion of education and growth for some of the galaxy's most needy. It's incarcerated. That, however, is feeling more and more like it might never happen unless we resolve our current crisis. So it might be best if you just moved along. Not here to sign up, but, you know, I might be able to help you. Oh, that's awfully kind of you, but... And I totally forgot to use my power. You know... We could use some more manpower, actually. Speak to Sloane. There's no man She's available, I'm She's been taking I'm point sorry. on the... Well, uh, she'll be able to explain it all. There's an NB and there's an Andresia. So, what is it that you do here? Uh, I'm the facility's chief administrator, co-head of the whole retreat with Sloane. She handles most of the resident side of things. Making sure we've got the right people for the program, and those people have the right tools to succeed in their own development. I keep the lights on and make sure things hum along smoothly. Which has been harder of late. What was that argument all about? Well, our construction foreman, Mr. Halftown, is understandably upset that a member of his crew has gone missing. It's put a complete stop to all work on the facility, as Mr. Halftown's crew doesn't believe the staff and myself can be trusted with their well-being. And our attempts to defuse the situation by finding the missing crewmen have failed thus far. Sloane's been trying to keep everyone calm, but I honestly don't know how much longer this can go on. So, oh, what do you do around here? Currently, very little. But once we're open... 
Should that day ever come, we hope to have all manner of training and personal development courses available for our residents. Most of our staff are formerly incarcerated themselves, so we hope to be able to provide a level of service unlike any other in the galaxy. You're all criminals? What'd you do? Ah, I am the sole exception. I was a neighborhood administrator for years in New Atlantis. Was tasked with maintaining the well section of the city. Home to many of the UC's most underprivileged citizens. I saw firsthand what havoc the bounty system could cause in a neighborhood. Parents in prison, money funneled away from basic needs. It can become a, a cycle. Here, we hope to give people the tools to escape it. Why is this still highlighted, mm. though? Currently? But once... Should that day ever come? We hope to have... Most of us... Oh, well. Take care, please. Okay, I think... Okay, free talk is still up. Yeah, it says... <sighs> right, there. right. I'm so bored. I can't get my eyes to focus. Unless something's wrong with the air in this place. I'd get out of here while you can. I would, if it wouldn't get me fired. They're not gonna just have us sit here, right? They gotta scrap the job. Your abilities are the crew is right? lifting up truly amazing. My man is found. Can't believe I bought into this place's crap reform program story. I will go deal with the drive. Okay. Uh, should I continue or pause? You can continue. I'll okay. Before. You seem really concerned for this worker. What's keeping you from finding him yourself? Because I'm not the one whose job it is to keep this place secure. What a dick. I'm just the guy who thought I could trust the people giving us this job. So, are you interested in helping the galaxy's criminals too? Is that why you took the job? Why does anyone take any job? Credits. And these Dollar folks have plenty. Yo, got it. But I mean, come on. What they're selling here? Fixing the settled systems by giving criminals career training? You really think the Crimson Fleet are just one typing course away from becoming model citizens? No, but there are some people who are. Yeah. I mean, if they had been given them more options available to in life, then yeah. Maybe they would be. Some of them would be. Yes, some. This is not everybody. Never been on the receiving side I of just a visit killed from the two fleet, fleets. Huh? And look, I know some folks have a tough out there. I've employed my fair share of ex-cons over the years. But you know how they turn their lives around? They did their time and got jobs instead of making the same bad choices again. Those are options everyone's already got. No retreat required. No, no that's Some not. Some people don't have good choices. You gave those employees stable lives. That's exactly what the retreat wants you to do. Andreja, please stop knocking me around. <laughs> Everything else is future. Only. Everything's future. You must have had brilliant surgeons. There's no scar from where they removed your heart. That is a pretty good line, I will agree, but... You are getting lost in the method, despite your goals being aligned. Yeah, but the pathway to that goal matters. If they're all here just sitting around learning a trade, just like they would on a job site, huh? <laughs> maybe, maybe you got a point there. But I'm sure you didn't come here just for a debate. Let's talk about something else. What is it that you do, or, or I guess don't do around here? I'm supposed to be the construction foreman. It's my job to make sure the Helios retreat gets built to whatever standard these folks want so they can run this reform program or whatever. But it's also my responsibility to make sure my crew can do their job safely, which sure as hell isn't the case right now with one of my people missing. So right now, I'm just waiting. So uh, this missing worker, wanna help? Oh, yeah? <laughs> you can't be worse than the situation we're already in. The boss, Sloane, she's heading up the manhunt, if you can even call it that. Talk to her and she'll get you up to speed. 
You're we'll be around. Also, somebody stole your sleeping spot, apparently. <laughs> That's why we got shifted around. Low gravity? Yes. A little. Well, I was noticing I was bouncing a little higher than normal. Oh, wait, no, that's right. This character has... No, it's the other character of mine that has good bouncing. Because bouncing is what Lara's do best. That's a crystal. Yeah. I mean, that's an interesting centerpiece. Yep. I am skeptical of whether this retreat will achieve its goals, but I applaud their efforts. Crackers! Sorry. And in one of the bedrooms, there's a magazine, but it's just for a recipe, so you don't care. What do you mean? This is the character that does make things. Huh? Yeah. Power. I'm sorry, love, but the Elios retreat isn't taking new residents right now. We've had some issues. A missing person chief among them. But you're welcome to rest up and refuel here as long as you'd like. I don't need to refuel. So long as there's ever. no bounty hunter after you that's going to kick my brand new door off its hinges. You guys get a lot of bounty hunters kind of hitting property damage around here? Not yet, but it's certainly a risk given the retreat's intended line of business. But I'm not about to send anyone packing who might just need a place to collect themselves. What is the Ilios retreat? Well, at the moment, it's primarily a collection of shipping containers and yeah, unused fair. construction materials. But the plan is to make this place into a growth and education residence for the galaxies incarcerated. We'll offer job training and a support network for folks that otherwise just while away their days in prison just because they didn't have the credits to pay their own bounties. Get them all the tools they need to set up regular, boring lives like the rest of us. That is a pretty noble goal. Well, thank you. Always striving to make my presence in the universe a net positive. But still got a lot of ground to cover. But I'm sure you didn't come all this way just to listen to me blabber. You're probably exhausted. Yes, but Monica should have any supplies you might need. She's just out front of the main building. And our ship services tech is out near the landing pad if your vessel needs some tending to. And if you need anything else, or just want to talk, you come find me. Yep, I saw. So... Everyone's got a checkered past here, right? What'd you do? If you can believe it, I was Crimson Fleet. Scouring the skies for loot and glory. Ended up finding a hefty prison sentence instead, which, honestly, was probably the best for me and the galaxy at large. Uh, yeah, I expect that was a tough life. You'd expect right even at the best of times. But I'm sure you didn't come here for an ancient history lesson. Was the... What's your job here? Well, once we officially open our doors, the retreat's going to have to be a lot of things to the formerly incarcerated folks we plan to bring here. Residence, school, a place for reflection. Nevin, he handles everything infrastructure related, while I take care of everything our residents might need to get them moving along healthier paths. I make sure we've got the facilities to support everyone. I arrange all our occupational training. Even got my counseling certification a few years back so I can serve as a compassionate ear when people need it. I want to help. I want our effort to help find him. That the truth? Because I can't say it's going to be easy work. But if you found the construction crew's missing man, we'd all owe you. You can tell me about this construction work. Well, he was last seen a few days ago, so we don't think he could have gotten far. We sent our lone security officer to find him, but things didn't go according to plan out there, and now he's taken up residence in our infirmary. So if you're offering, we'll absolutely take the help. Not gonna be easy, huh? Why is that? 
this planet is not the most accommodating to human life. There's worse. It's wild, empty, and the local fauna, well, they're not big fans of humans. So while I will absolutely take your help if you're offering it, I just want you to be aware I don't expect it's going to be a walk in the park. I'll bring back your man. You don't know how happy I am to hear it. First things first. You want to speak to Greg D'Angelo, our security officer. He was wounded searching for our worker, Mr. Kilman's trail. He should be able to get you pointed toward Kilman's last known location. All right, and with that, I will go ahead and save. I hope you've enjoyed this internet, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye! Bye.